So hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Indian Mom Cooking. So today I've come up with an easy recipe and that is called a coriander rice. So I'm going to show you uh, how to make coriander rice easily. This is very useful for ki kids lunch box and we'll get started. So I've taken a bunch of coriander leaves and washed them and uh, dried them and one medium sized onion and then followed by green chilies and ginger. And I've taken a medium glass full of basmati rice, washed them and soaked them in water. And for the tatka, I'm going to add uh, cashew nuts, urad dal, mustard seeds, dried red chilies and few curry leaves. And salt to taste as well. And you will need olive oil. So it's up to your choice. You can add any oil of your choice. And to a blender, I'm going to add the green chilies, ginger, coriander leaves with little water and blend them into a fine paste. So this is going to be the base of coriander. So the consistency should be of this one. So keep them aside. Now uh, in a separate pan, I'm going to cook the basmati rice. So it's cooked now. So I'm going to just keep them aside. So let's get started. So in a kara, I'm going to add about two tablespoon of olive oil. So it's up to your choice. You can add refined oil or uh, ghee. So to that, I'm going to add the mustard seeds, urad dal and the cashew nuts. Make sure to keep the flame on medium and stir them. And stir them until they become golden brown in color. So after the they turn brown color, it's time to add in the curry leaves and the dried red chilies. So make sure to keep the flame on medium, otherwise the dry red chilies will get burnt. And followed by one uh, medium sized onion that are uh, sliced into julienne's and I'm going to add that. Stir it for a minute. And now I'm going to cook this onion for 3 to 5 minutes with the lid closed. So it's been 5 minutes, the onions are softened. And now I'm going to add the blended mixture. So uh, we have kept uh, the coriander, ginger and the green chilies mixture. So I'm going to add in to the onions. And it is very important to keep the flame on medium. Otherwise the coriander mixture will taste bitter later. So keeping the flame on medium, I'm going to stir it and cook them for three to five minutes on medium flame. So now add required salt at this stage. So stir them and check for seasoning at this stage. So it's been 5 minutes. The coriander rice mixture is ready. Now we can add in the basmati rice little by little and stir them gently. So add required amount of basmati rice and uh, stir them until the masala gets well into the rice. So yes, this is how simple easy it is to make coriander rice. So I hope you like this recipe. So if you like my recipe, please click on that subscribe button and also click on the bell button so that you will get notified whenever I upload a new video. This rice will be help most helpful for kids lunchbox recipe and office lunch recipe as well. So until next time, stay happy.